guys, welcome back to my channel. Today I want to show you how I mix chalk pastels to create my own shade for detailing my cupcakes. This is a very simple tutorial and I hope you like it. Um, this is what you're going to need to get started. First, you're going to need your chalk pastels. I use this Artist Loft I found at Michael's. They are very affordable and they have a lot of colors in one box. Also, you're going to need something to mix your chalk pastels. I use my favorite Sculpey tool that I've been using in every tutorial. And also, you're going to need a blade uh, or exacto blade or whatever you have on hand to scratch your chalk pastels. And also, you're going to need two pieces of paper. So the process is very simple. I already have my shades uh, and what I want to do is create more of the same colors. So I will start mixing four colors for the lighter one. It's a yellow and this I think is ochre and uh, some orange and a little bit of white. And what I'm going to do after scratching all my chalk pastels is mixing them in this small piece of paper. Once they're mixed, I like to compare both colors and uh, I start correcting, adding a little bit of um, orange or any other color that it needs to have the similar color than the one that I had before. And for the dark shade, I'm going to do exactly the same but using different colors. Uh, I start with some brown, then I add a little bit of red, a little bit of light ochre, and a little bit of white. This is uh, exactly how I mix my shades every time I make them. exactly as I did before when I finish mixing I start comparing both shades and I correct if it's necessary and once I'm finished I just put the mix into my contact lenses case that I use to keep all my frostings and also my chalk pastel mixtures. And that's it. It's really simple and actually I believe this is the best way to have all your creations with the same shades and the same tones and the same color every time you make them. So I hope you enjoyed this tutorial. Please, if you liked it, subscribe now and uh, I hope to see you next time. Bye!